A small trailer type video clip was recently released by Northrop Grumman. This small clip was focused on women empowerment, however, what is interesting that it had two aircrafts in the background. One was the Ita Hawkeye wax, and the other one was the actual surprise, or sort of surprise. This surprise was an unknown aircraft that could most probably be NGAD design. NGAD stands for Next Generation, Air Dominance, is a program, being run by the United States Air Force since 2014. NGAD is a sixth-generation fighter jet development program that would replace F-22 Raptor in the future. It is believed that this future aircraft shall start entering service with the U.S. Air Force in 2030. If that is the case, then this aircraft must be an actual prototype. If we look closer, this aircraft resembles with the design of Northrop Grumman's YF-23 a fifth-generation fighter prototype that was in competition with YF-22 for Advanced Tactical Fighter or ATF program, that ultimately was won by Lockheed Martin's YF-22. But it doesn't mean that YF-23 wasn't capable enough. In fact, it was believed to be superior to YF-22 in some case, such as stealth capability and IR suppression system, that is expected of NGAD, however, YF-22 better suited U.S. Air Force requirements and won the contract. Let's talk about some capabilities that are expected from this future fighter jet. NGAD would bring new capabilities in the theater of war, with a super stealthier design. It would bridge the remaining man-machine interface with man-to-man -man teaming system. It would also bring on board direct energy weapons for the first time, with a revolutionary adaptive cycle propulsion system. The adaptive cycle propulsion system development was started for F-35 fighter jet. But now they are focusing this technology to integrate with new upcoming platforms, such as NGAD. So the General Electric has been working on the concept of adaptive cycle engine for a while now, that would be capable of changing bypass ratio, and could switch between the efficiency and power, accordingly to the requirements. According to General Electric, it would be a fuel-efficient engine and would provide 30% more range with less fuel consumption. This would allow the aircraft to conduct long-range, long-endurance operations, a capability that its predecessors, such as F-35 and F-22 lack. It would also increase the availability rate and with low operational cost, because these are the issues that U.S. Air Force has been facing with its fifth-generation fighter jets. NGED isn't just a fighter, it's a set of systems in itself. This includes man-on-man -man teaming system, next-generation weapon systems such as directed energy weapons, and highly suppressed IO signature of the aircraft. So overall, this project seems to be very ambitious and expensive. The per unit cost would be hundreds of millions of dollars, which indicates that the induction numbers would be limited, like F-20 to Raptor. All the major world powers are working on their sixth generation fighter jet development programs. This includes China's JXX program, and two separate joint programs led by Britain and France. China also showcased a mysterious mock-up model of a future aircraft at Zhuhai Airshow 2022, but U.S. still seems to be ahead with pace in future aircraft development program. Thanks for watching, like and share this video, and follow for more.